The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. I know that it's tempting to try to do percentage word problems in your head, but this leads to a variety of careless mistakes. So I would advise always writing out the equation by simply reading the problem from left to right and solving it from there. That way you don't have to think about the problem at all until you get to your final answer. So for this problem we have what percent? Since we know that percent means over 100 and what means x, what percent would be x over 100? Of means times 36 is 36, is means equals, and 81 is 81. We can rewrite this problem as 36x over 100 equals 81. To get rid of the fraction, we multiply both sides by 100, and we have 36x equals 8100, dividing both sides by 36. You can use a calculator to find that x equals 225. Now let's check to see if our answer makes sense. We have 225 percent of 36 is 81. Well, we know that 100 percent of 36 would be 36. So 225 percent of 36 should be a lot more than 36. So 81 seems to make sense.